Elizabeth, I have a lot of friends in Victoria, and I know that the current MP is a very strong supporter of the environment. How come the Greens are also running a candidate? You know, I was very familiar with Parliament before getting elected. I'd, I'd worked in Ottawa as a senior policy advisor to the Minister of Environment back in the 80s. And I know the rules of Parliament. And there is such a thing as a whipped vote, where every member of Parliament is told by their party leader how they must vote. No choices, no chances to disagree or debate the point. They're told how to vote. The biggest surprise for me since I became a member of Parliament is that these days, every vote is a whipped vote. The members of Parliament for the New Democrats, for example, 100% of the time, 100% of the New Democrats vote the way Tom Mulcair tells them to. It's been a real surprise to me. I, I was the only member of Parliament to vote against the aerial bombardment of Libya in June of 2011. The only one. And there were a lot of my friends in other parties who were very much against continued aerial bombardment when a peace offer was on the table. But they were told how to vote, and they do what they're told. And that's the single biggest difference between a Green Party MP and a Conservative MP, a Liberal MP, or a New Democrat MP, is that we have a policy in the Green Party that does not permit a whipped vote. We believe that we are running a slate of intelligent, principled candidates. And they will not check their brains at the door on election. They will continue to think things through and vote as their conscience and their constituents want them to.